Hey everyone, it's Whitney, and today I'm going to be doing a review for you guys on some hard candy products that I was sent. I wanted to share them with you guys and let you guys know what I thought of them, what I like and what I don't like. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. So hard candy can be found at Walmart, and I really like that you can buy it at Walmart, that it's really accessible, anyone can get it. Um, the prices are a little more expensive than, you know, Wet n Wild and stuff like that, so it's a little more pricey, but I really think the packaging is really cute and the quality is amazing. Their stuff is very pigmented and I really like that about it, um, especially for a drugstore brand. It really reminds me of like a Sephora higher end quality and the packaging really reminds me kind of the Urban Decay look to it. So let's go ahead and get started. The first product that I wanted to share with you guys is their Plumping Serum Volumizing Lip Gloss, and that's what it looks like. This one is number 335, and it's called Life Preserver, Life Preserver, and it's this really pretty kind of bubblegum pink with a ton of golden glitter in it, but it's really, really pretty. I love the packaging, and it's just, it's really cute. So anyways, I really love the smell of this. It smells, it reminds me of um, kind of like MAC lip glasses. They smell like kind of cake batter. This reminds me of that a lot. Um, I love how it applies. It's just a doe foot applicator. Looks like that. And it's just really, really nice that it lasts me, you know, several hours and I don't have to touch this up. I only have to put on like one coat of this. It's not like I have to put on like 10 layers of this to get pigmentation because this is pigmented and it's just gorgeous. It looks really pretty on on the lips. I have it on right now over top of the MAC Viva Glam Gaga and I think it's really beautiful. Um, I just really, really like this a lot. The next thing that I wanted to share with you guys is their Hide and Glow Cheek. It's a duo cheek tint. And it's really neat because it has an end up here. It's a double-ended um, cheek tint or stain. Um, and anyways, you can pull this one off and use this one. And it just you just kind of do that. Turn it and it comes up. And then you can use the other side. Just like that. So anyways, I'm going to swatch these for you guys and let you guys see what they look like. Alright, I went ahead and swatched the Hide and Glow Cheek uh, Tint for you guys. This is actually Hot Date 317, and uh, if you guys are looking for that at Walmart, that's what that looks like. And so, this bright one right here, or this brighter one, like this, is actually this very first one right here. As you can see, it's a very, very pretty kind of bright pink. And the next one is the darker one, which is this right here. I really think that this one, the darker one, would look really good if you had a uh, darker skin uh, tone than mine. I'm pretty fair, so I think this would look really nice on someone a little darker than myself. But I think the brighter one would look really nice on someone, um, you know, like my skin tone or a lighter, fair complexion. So that's what that looks like. And then I swatched them together because you can wear these actually together, so that's really neat. And this is what they look like mixed. It's kind of a, um, I don't know, like a watermelon color actually, I think. Yeah. So, I mean, they are all really, really gorgeous, and I really like these a lot. Um, so basically what I do when I apply these is, um, you know, after I've put my foundation and all that, I will go ahead and stick this on and kind of blend it into my skin before I set my face at all. Just, um, you know, just because you want to do the uh, cream cream and liquid stuff first before you ever set anything with powder. So I really like these. Um, the last all day long for me uh, if you set it and everything like that. But very pigmented, very gorgeous, and I really do like this. Alright, the very last product that I wanted to talk to you guys about is the Glamouflage Heavy Duty Concealer. This one is in medium, and it actually came with a little concealer pencil like this, 
which is really nice and really handy if you have any pimples or redness. Um, you can definitely just rub this on top of it and then take your finger and kind of blend it in or you could even use a brush and it works really really nicely. I really like this uh, for like pimples or redness as well. Um, if you have something that needs a little more attention I think this definitely works. Um, I really don't like to use this underneath my eyes because it is a heavy duty concealer and I really feel like it gets really cakey especially if you have darker under eye circles you, you, you know you like need more of the concealer it really gets cakey and I really don't like the way it looks but other than that for pimples or redness or anything like that scarring or anything like that even tattoos it definitely would work um, it covers up anything it's very pigmented and like I said you only need to use like a teeny teeny little little amount of this and I think this like tube uh, would last you quite a while because you only need so little um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this review and I hope it was helpful if you're over at Walmart just like wandering around in the makeup aisle definitely check out the hard candy products they have all kinds of stuff they have um, a lot of stuff that um, you know Sephora and higher end brands have but L'Oreal and you know Wet n Wild don't have so it's really nice and convenient at Walmart so hope you guys enjoyed this I hope you guys are doing well and I will see you guys soon